What up, guys? Some more solos with Gibbs rising through the bluebies. We got Jazer. I've heard of this little fellow doing some montages all the time. Uh, let's see if he gets any cool freestyles on me. I'll put it in my own montage, Jazer. All right, he took a little bit long to get back. I'm not sure what happened on his face off. I think he went for my boost, maybe? I'm not really sure where he went. Yeah, maybe he was, like, flailing a bit after the face off. So he couldn't get back. So let's see how it goes here. Just want to counteract his fast face host by flipping early. I should not have done that. That was actually poor. Oh, I could have scored there. I was not expecting him to whiff like that. All right. I have time to get boost. He's going up the wall, so. Going to do some crazy shot. Oh, the, the the double touch there. I was not expecting that. That looked really strange on my screen. <clears throat> I, I saw the first hit, like, right there. And then, like, that second hit just looked really, really funky. So I wasn't expecting it. I should have been closer to my near side post, but I wanted a more like aggressive clear if he didn't actually shoot it and threw it off my sidewall. That's why I was positioned there. I just got a challenge. Actually didn't go in my favor really off that bounce, but that was a kind of poor hit. It's fine. Give him the ball, but I'll take the boost. See what he does here. He went for the aerial. Then he saw me back up. So... Trying to force him to just hit that. He did, but I think he wanted to do that. There, I'm just kind of baiting him in there. Like, if you go a little bit later on those clears, they'll think they might have a chance. And now I'm just talking too much, so I'm screwing things up here. Just got it over him. All right, there we go. We got the goal. <clears throat> um, yeah, this dribble, I was just trying to launch it off my side. Just a little bit in the air. And, like, nothing crazy. Of course, if it's a better toss, it's, it's always better, but... That was good enough. Oh, he wins that. Okay. Ooh, just got in his way. Very, very close. And I got the boost at least, so we're good. See what he wants to do here. He's going for it. A little surprising. He tried to launch it over me. I just got up in time. Now he might be screwed, yeah. See, it's hard when you're on the inside wall to, um... To try for any really good moves, because then, yeah, like, if you get bumped out or anything like that, like, he he landed poorly, and it just turned into a free goal for me. It's really tough, because, like, those 50-50s are basically always, like, I'll win them, because unless it goes in, it, it's not really going to make any difference for him, because he's on a bad angle, like, near my goal on the wall, so more than likely, the 50-50 will go poorly for him. Oh, I missed. Rip. Wanting to get in his way. This works, though. Now the ball is dribbling towards me, so he can't really do anything with it. There I actually get the dribble and the flip for the boost, which is really, really helpful. Uh, that saved me there, basically. Jay's just kind of flung on about here a bit. Try and shoot it high. See, see if he'll make the save. Okay, he didn't. Here I was taking my time. I knew he didn't really have a play. As soon as I saw him going for his boost, and then I just got to roll it out to the side, hook around behind it, and then get ready for my shot. And Jazer just barely misses that shot. I actually wanted to throw it behind him, but uh, I just didn't get enough angle on it. But it still worked out. Uh-oh. What's he doing? No, Jazer. Jazer! What are you doing? Shit. Probably shouldn't have scored there. I'll see what, he, what he's doing. Maybe he's just like, ah, GG. But... Four goals is not a lot in ones. Like, you can definitely come back from that. You back? He's not back. Oh, down goes Jazer. Okay, so Jazer's gone. Pretty good win there. Jazer's a very good opponent. And we'll take it. Throw some candy on the field for all the fans. And, yeah, let's move on to game number two. See what we get. Maybe we'll get him again. Who knows? Who knows? Probably not a ton of people on right now. Uh, but, yeah. Either he was done. Oh, he's added me to his friends list. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. I wanted games with carpet. But he doesn't want games with me. He doesn't. He hates me. Uh, blah, 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 blah. The Jazer. All right. Game number two. We're waiting. I should probably turn on Rocket League Trainer. I haven't really used it much. I really need to get back into it. Um... It's on my desktop somewhere. I'm joining the game anyway, but yeah, I definitely got to pick some 
shots out of it and start working on some stuff and when i'm waiting in between games okay hakiko see how this game goes it's a pretty bad server for usc's purposes for me 48 but he's on 72 so that evens it out a bit nice shot oh just missing all right i'm just waiting here i actually don't really want to do too much with this i just want to get his boost if i can if he lets me yeah he does okay so he plays off the wall i get the boost I gotta just back up on that. Trying to cut this quickly so I can get a second shot like this. But I actually meant to, to front flip there. And I didn't. My bad. Oh, that's a bad idea. Never go off the wall. Never go off the wall in ones. Unless you really, really are confident. I wouldn't bother. Because you need like a perfect hit. To, um... For it to matter for you. Like, you basically need a goal. Because if you don't get a goal, then you're in the air for way too long. And you can't do anything. Like, if I save that in any way, I have, like, a free five seconds for a goal. You know he's got nothing. I'll just fight it out. He's grabbing his boost, though. I'm just going to leave and get boost. It's not worth it for me to challenge in his zone with maybe 24 boosts from boost pads. So. He actually just throws a shot on that. That's actually a really bad idea. Because then I just get a free clear. Turn it into my own shot. I actually missed here. Luckily, I landed correctly on the wall. That's what the air rolls for, ladies and gentlemen. So then you can come back really quickly on that play. Just trying to kill this along here. Not trying to, like, jump off the wall there. Trying for the bump. Got the bump, but I'm not going to be able to get this ball anyway. Almost. So the bump took me out of the play a bit, too, so I couldn't make it happen. I'll let him clear. That's fine. Just don't want him to pop that off his head. I can go off this wall since he's not in net yet. So see, like, right when the ball lands, I'm already landing, too. So by the time he has a play in the ball, I also have a play in the ball, so it wasn't that bad. He doesn't really like to dribble. Oh, there we go. He got something off from me. He went for boost, though. Try and get the bumps. Spun him out a bit. I'm going to fake this. Ah, uh, damn. He didn't, like, dive as hard as I thought he was going to. Ooh, I didn't think he was going to get that. I thought I had the free shot. He's going for the boost. This is dangerous for him. And it's not that dangerous when I do that, though. Bad dribble to start it. Needed a much better first touch. All right. Let's throw this gently along the wall so he can't really get a great angle on a shot. Again, he went off the wall again. I do a bad first touch, though. Two bad first touches there. That cost me two goals, so that's really, really critical in ones to get a good first touch. Like, this is a much... Nope, see, that second touch was bad. I'm just awful today. And then I missed that. Too much talking, you know, while I'm playing. Um, yeah, but you want those quality first touches whenever you can. There we go. Just drive it over. So I try for the fake here to see if he moves, but since... He's seen me fake a lot. He's going to be patient. But that also leads me into just throwing it on top of my head and just popping it over him. So you like you kind of just got to play with him a bit. Um, change it up a bit. Or use that you've been faking a lot to do something else right after. Uh, which actually worked really well there. Problem is I can't score for the life of me right now. He's going to try and pop. I just wanted to challenge quickly. He was in a really good spot there. And my challenge was risky, but it, it paid off. So it's all good. So here... Just gonna throw it off the wall, but I'm not gonna jump, so now I'm still in play. I don't know what I'm doing anymore. I really don't know, I guess. Just don't know anymore. Another bad touch on the ground. Ooh, I didn't think he was gonna go for it. At least this is, should bounce up. This gives me a second chance at getting back. Yeah. He tries to the air because he's like, I have a free shot if I can land it, but he couldn't. And that's a goal. He gets there. Ooh, he almost got there. Here we go. <clears throat> um. Yeah, not playing great. I'm not getting some good first touches on my dribbles. But, um, you know, it happens. He went for my boost. Now he's kind of in a bad spot. Probably shouldn't have even played that. Because now I can just drive past him for a free goal. Like, you're better off. Like, if you don't get the boost and you can't make a good hit, um, just leave for that mid boost. Like, he, he touched it and then I just had to drive it right by him. That's the main difference between boost or no boost. Like, you should never be on the offensive side if you have zero boost. Unless you're super confident that you're going to win that ball. Um, but generally, you don't want to be on the offensive side with zero boost. Because you can't get back in time if something goes wrong. Which in ones, things go wrong all the time. I don't know why I jumped there. I thought he was going to go for some other type of hit. He did not. I have 23 boosts. I'm going to collect some boost pads here. He dribbled it right into me, luckily. So, get another freebie out of it. There, I was just, like, I was just picking up welfare and seeing what type of hits he's going to do. But he wound up turning right into me. Um... 
We get a free goal out of it. Alright, bad face off for me. He should get this goal. He can. Alright, never mind. Just barely beat him back. See, again, 50 50s in my own end are really good for me, no matter what. Unless it goes in the net. That's how. No, I was gonna have a little fun, but it, I hit it too hard. No. Ooh, just gets it over me, but he missed again. Is going up the curve? Nope. Ooh. I hesitated for like a split second. I could have probably got back. But good goal by him. It's for the Brazil, though. For the Brazil. We got this. He's doing pretty good on the faceoffs. He keeps winning. I'm putting me in bad spots. I actually need to get this boost. Dribble it along my side. Doesn't really matter if it's in front of my net. He's not expecting that. Don't want to jump for that again. Not off the wall, at least. Because if I don't get a perfect hit, I'm screwed. So I'll come down and then see that I still have a shot. And I just barely sneak this by him. Alright, let's go. No, gotta save the Brazil. Oh, wow, that was really bad. It was so soft, I was not expecting that at all. Alright, that's why. We're good. Try and bump him out while I play this ball. There we go. Just throw it along the wall just to get it by him. Because he's going to play more towards his net. Pop that up. See if I can get around to it. Yes, just barely get around to it. So here I knew he was guarding the inside post. Uh, let's see. Let's see if he was. Yeah, he's like right in the inside post. So I know I, I just have to pop it. And then try and boost quickly. So I know he has to turn around. But I'm already facing that direction. So I can get the speed up quicker than him. And beat him to that ball. So that's why I just did that little toss. Alright. Let's go back. Just again, slow it across my net. Actually worked out that I hit my own post. Didn't mean to. And we'll take a turtle goal to end it. Why not? The post um, helped there a bit. Because <clears throat> he dove for it hard. Because uh, it was actually softer than I wanted uh, to go across my net. But he still couldn't reach it. Keep it up, dude. Oh, he tried. GG, buddy. All right, we got it. Throw some candy on the field for all the fans. And that'll do it, guys, for another Rising Through the Bluebies solos with Gibbs. I don't even know what to call this anymore. I just don't know. But that was some ones games, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. We actually won, so that's nice. And uh, we'll see you next time. Later.